the pain was the the dressing changes and the baths is one of the things that I remember the most. It was just absolutely excruciating. I lit a candle which I knew that I wasn't allowed to light and I had it sitting on the dressing table in my bedroom. I leant over to pick something up or wipe something off my foot and in an absolute instant it just ignited and went up. I spent 10 weeks in hospital. Um, for the first six weeks I had to lay on my back with my arms out to my side to 90 degrees. Even once I was discharged from hospital after 10 weeks, I still had to have dressing changes, ongoing physio, ongoing return trips to Melbourne for checkups and operations for the next 11 years because as I grew, my skin didn't stretch. I believe that the, the first step in prevention is awareness. And my story shows that we have that mentality of it will never happen to me. I had that mentality. What we can do is we can educate our children about fire safety, burns awareness. It's not about removing those risks. It's about teaching them, teaching them how to be safe around fire. And it's about teaching them that if the unthinkable does happen, what to do.